Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm hiking out to the Buckskin Gulch. First, we're passing through the Wire Pass Slot Canyon, which is just down below me here, and out to that slot canyon out there. Really amazing landscape out here. The $6 day pass permit, essentially, to be allowed to access Buckskin Gulch and the Wire Pass Slot Canyon. Uh, we are actually very close to Vermilion Cliffs National Monument, but I believe this is actually the Perea River wilderness area that I'm actually in right now. I've heard this is a really cool hike, and I'm excited to explore these canyons down here. So, yeah, let's go for it. There's a crow up on that piece of wood up there that's lodged in between the canyon. He's been making a lot of noise and squawking <laughs> when I was walking down the canyon. I feel like he's not very happy that I'm down in his canyon. Let's take a few photos of him. Pretty, pretty large crow. Like a very big bird hanging out up there. <laughs> So this has been the Buckskin Gulch, which from what I understand is actually the longest traversable slot canyon in, in the world. Like I believe it's like over 30 miles one way and you can actually hike the entirety of the canyon, but you have to get back backcountry permits and, and stuff like that to uh, be allowed to do that because you also have to camp in the canyon overnight. And I believe it might actually be possible to hike this all the way to the Colorado River, which would be a long way and that would actually cross over the Utah or Arizona border into Arizona. I'm probably only a couple miles north of the Arizona border right now, so I'm in very, very far southern Utah, almost in Arizona. It was a pretty cool hike. I decided to actually not start my hike until late afternoon into the evening, and I tend to do that with a lot of my hikes because I feel like most of the time it seems like I can avoid a lot of the crowds by starting my hiking in the late afternoon into evening, and the temperatures start to cool down a little bit when it starts getting these warmer 
late spring, summer months. Most people seem to like to do morning, early afternoon hikes. So when I was hiking in to the canyon, everyone was hiking out. And now that I'm out here, I've mostly gotten the entire slot canyon and canyon to myself, which is really amazing. I generally also like to shoot sunset, which then means that no, I will hike out in the evening. One thing you just be okay with someone's hiking back to your car on the trail in the dark, because when you stay for sunset and you're a couple miles out, you know, the wilderness or something, then you're hiking back in the dark. Today, I'm not staying all the way till sunset, so I won't be hiking back in the dark, but just something to keep in mind for evening hiking. I hope you guys did enjoy this short little hike into Buckskin Gulch, world's longest slot canyon, even if I only hiked a couple miles into it. May someday I'll come back and hike the entirety of the canyon and say that I have hiked the world's longest slot canyon, but that adventure might have to wait for another time. If you guys did enjoy the video, I'd like to see more videos about landscape photography, hiking, and backcountry camping, national parks, stuff like that. Feel free to subscribe to my channel down below. Leave me a comment, and uh, yeah, let me know what you thought of the hike and some of the images. And uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.